is only listen when you can safely close your eyes. My name is Jason Newland and my website is jasonnewland.com I'd like you to get yourself comfortable sitting comfortably or lying down maybe on a bed or a sofa and just notice how you feel right now in this moment being aware of the physical sensations in your face your eyes your jaw your throat the sides of your neck the back of your neck your shoulders your upper arms your elbows your forearms your wrists chest your stomach from your 
collarbone all the way down to your belly button. Covering your ribs, your nipples, your armpits, the sides of your body, a part that is sometimes just ignored in these type of recordings like the tops of the sides around your chest the muscles of the chest connect to the muscles of the back and of course the ribs you can feel the ribs on the sides moving around, protecting your major organs. And then as you move down to your abdominal region, Just observe the feelings above your belly button and also that area below moving towards your groin area. So the sides, your sides are lower down just below you, above your hips. That area is quite gentle, quite soft sometimes. As you focus on the back of your neck and that line that goes down all the way down to your lower back moving Focusing on either side of your spine, just being aware of the feelings in your back. shoulders, maybe just raising them up a little bit and let them drop down. You can feel that large area becoming more relaxed.
still of your back. Moving down into your lower back. You may notice physical sensations depending upon which muscle group you focus on possibly you feel more relaxed in one part of your back than maybe you do instantly in other parts You may have noticed that a certain part of your back feels a little bit stiff, in need of deep relaxation. allowing yourself to just decide to relax that part of your body Maybe every part of your body.
calmly letting go. As you focus on your groin area and your buttocks, noticing the whole of your hips, relaxing. muscles in your thighs, just allowing them to relax gradually in their own time, allowing them to stretch out and deflate. Think about it like that. Think about your knees in a 
slightly different way. They actually not only begin to relax deeply, but there's a certain feeling that you may be experiencing in your knees. A certain pleasure A certain release. As you now focus on your calf muscles and your shins. Just like the knees and your thighs your shins and your calf muscles and of course your ankles all contribute and work as a team to allow you to do the things that you do to allow you to use your legs working in unison most of the time not even considered not even taken notice of because we just assume that everything's going to work fine and most of the time, thankfully, everything does work fine however, it can still be nice to actually recognize all of the work that your legs have done and continue to do for you every day so that your calf muscles and your shins and your ankles don't only start Starting 